summer may be winding down, but don't put away the bug spray just yet. Mosquito borne diseases are common and this year there is something new. An infection known as triple E is being reported in at least five states, including in Wisconsin. Veronica from Rogers emailed us and wanted to know how concerned should we be? Are mosquito borne diseases becoming a bigger threat? Kirsten Mitchell spoke to the health department to answer those good questions. How are the bugs this year? The bug uh, this year is they were crazy. Whether you've been eaten alive. I did have one camping experience where I was just covered in mosquito bites. Or spared this summer. Not too bad. Health officials say don't let your guard down just yet. State fair is over, but bug season is not. Bug season isn't <laughs> quite. MDH epidemiologist supervisor Elizabeth Schiffman says mosquito-borne diseases peak at the end of the summer into early fall when there's a larger mosquito population and they've had more time to circulate viruses. I don't think it's something you know, we want people to panic about, of course, but definitely knowing that the risk is there and that this time of the year is definitely that highest risk time. In Minnesota, six mosquito-borne diseases are on the radar of health officials. The most common is West Nile virus. We see cases every year, um, but some years we have a lot of activity and some years not so much. Most who get infected have no symptoms, but for some, West Nile can be severe or deadly. I just react poorly to bites in general, so I'm always the kind of person that brings the bug spray and just covers myself, so I'll probably just keep doing that. We're hearing a lot about triple E lately. Health officials in New England are warning residents about the rare mosquito-borne eastern equine encephalitis known as triple E. Yeah, we hear it in the news. What exactly is triple E? It's actually the most serious of the mosquito-borne diseases that we have um, in the United States. It can cause flu-like symptoms and is deadly for about one-third who develop it. While triple E has been found in Wisconsin, no human cases have been reported in Minnesota. We in Minnesota are kind of on the western edge of sort of the range for that virus. Um, we have mosquitoes that can spread it, but we just don't see a lot of activity with it here. Are mosquito-borne diseases getting worse, more severe, more prevalent in recent years? You know, it's hard to say because it really depends from year to year. Schiffman says a warming climate could mean a longer mosquito season and greater spread of disease. Things are changing and viruses move, people move, and so it's very possible, you know, West Nile wasn't a virus we had in the United States 25 years ago. The best way to protect yourself just put on some spray is prevention. I try to avoid mosquito hour, like when the sun goes down. Um, I have good bonfires at nighttime, the smoke usually takes them away. You stay home. <laughs> yeah, you stay home. <laughs> With photojournalist Nick Luneman, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO News. The threat typically diminishes by the end of the month or in early October. The first hard frost will get rid of mosquitoes too.